this. I think it's run tutorial time. Alright. So, look. What you do. Now, this works on standalone. I'm pretty sure. I just haven't tried it. But, look. Your hand starts kind of right here. Like, wider part of your rib cage, right? And it flicks all the way out to, like, when your hand's like this, by the way. So it's boom, boom, where your hand's, like, center of your face, right? Boom. And it hits really hard. So it's like, hoo, 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 like that, right? And this hand comes up kind of, it's like L-shaped kind of, not really. But, and it just kind of flicks. Boom, to, like, the outer skirts of, like, where you can see it. So boom, it hits really hard. So it's like, <laughs> like that. And basically, if you get it right here, I'm going to run a gazebo because I usually hit the slide. Kind of slow right now because I'm on 120. And yeah. So, here. So, uh, yeah. Little bit of a run tutorial right there. Uh... I might go more in depth sometime in the future, but something you really want to practice is with the run to like rhythm is the most important thing when it comes to running. Like if you have bad rhythm, as in you're just like that, right? You won't go anywhere. Like even if you're hitting as hard as you physically can, you won't go anywhere. So you need to practice rhythm. So. Yeah, you can't go fast without it. And basically, what I mean by rhythm, for the people that won't know, is, like, think of a circle, right? And there's a dot on one side of the circle, and there's another dot on the other side of the circle. Both, like, they're both rotating, kind of like, like that. That's kind of what I mean by rhythm, right? Now, that probably didn't make uh, very much sense, because I'm not the best at explaining things, but, uh, yeah. Okay, so that's about all I can think of right now, but sometime in the future, I might make a more in-depth run tutorial. 